What's up people? I'm gonna make an experiment. I'm gonna farm 30 minutes inside open world dungeon and 30 minutes outside the field farm and let's see the result. After the 8 months of release game on the Korean region, we get the last week the game changer update. There is the whole system of the drop and whole system of the loot change to make anti-bot loot so bots cannot ruin your game anymore and uh, let's see how this everything affected on the mobs drops uh, on the casual farm so let's make this test and uh, let me show you the result but before that i want you guys ask you to subscribe my channel right now at this moment i play this game on the korean region i have a lot of knowledge about throne and liberty i'm making the guidelines which helps you so much once we get this game on the global market so hit the subscribe button and if you will like the video don't forget to hit the like button too okay now let's get back and watch the video
Alright, that was a 30 minute open world and 30 minute field farm. Let's see the results to compare each other. As you see the instance one is way, way, way much better. I got a lot of soul hunts by itself and I get a lot of enchanting materials for the crafting of for enchant your gear, enchant your armor, accessories and your skill book and also you can sell these marines on the auction house and also you can sell this marine to get more solant if it's necessary. So uh, this loot was not even close before the last week update. Before the last week update you was getting shit. It doesn't matter how much you was farming, if you was lucky you was getting some gear part or if you was not lucky you was not getting anything so after this update this loot system is looks okay it's have the reason to go and spend these points you know these abyssal contract token points now have idea to spend in the game and the people who love to farm they can go and they can farm and enjoy with the loot I hope this video was interesting for you, if you want to check all the type of the videos or the guidelines about Throne and Liberty or if you are interested with this game, I have really juicy guidelines for you guys which will be so much helpful once we get this game on the global market. So hit the subscribe button and if you like the video, don't forget to hit the like button too. As always guys, see you in the next video.